So, yep, busy, busy day. Um, looking really forward to it, man. It's like everything I'm doing is just clicking right now. Uh, I'm just so in my zone. I'm just so enjoying every little bit of this, every little bit of the struggle, every little bit of this, this business, every little bit of this life. It's just, I just love it. It is three o'clock. So got to go kite surfing. I was smiling the whole time, man. I mean, it wasn't the greatest win in the world, but I hadn't been in so long, and it was pretty. It was pretty good. It wasn't, you know, just cranking, but it was. It was good enough. I got a couple good jumps in, and. Uh, had a lot of fun riding some waves and just cutting up. Went with a 70 year old guy. This guy's 70 year old from Michigan. And uh, man, he was jumping and cutting up. And I mean, I couldn't believe it. He blew me away. I was, uh, he, he, he really inspired me today of what's possible, you know? Uh, past the age of what people think is possible. I mean, you're you're young as you think you are. That's gonna look good, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Hey, Mr. Ditta. Yeah. This is Ricky Carruth at Remax of Orange Beach. How you doing? Doing great. Good, man. Uh, I guess through the grapevine, I got led to you to show you this penthouse down here Saturday. Hello, Mr. Matt. Matt, Ricky Carruth. What's going on, Ricky? How are you, man? Ah, uh, living the dream. I hear, I hear you, dude. <laughs> if you're in St. Petersburg, you are living the dream. It's not bad, I'll tell you that. Yeah, I went there once. Super nice. So, welcome to the welcome to the club, man. Uh, yeah, thanks for uh, thanks for having me. Is there anything I can help you with right off the bat? Um. Yeah, I mean, right off the bat, um, I don't think so. I mean, a couple of uh, questions I have. I, I already have Mojo, and I, you know, do the three-line dialer and circle prospect already. I just kind of want to take it to a new level. And um, I guess, you know, one of the challenges I have is that, you know, during the day when I'm calling, I'm not getting anybody answering the phone. Um, and I know, like, right when I got into the coaching, it's like, make a thousand calls this week. And, um, like, just the... the time it takes to get those people on the phone is, I don't know, concerning to me. Is there, you know, something I'm missing? Is there better times to call? You know, so I, you're thinking a thousand conversations? That's what I was thinking you were. No, saying, no, it's just I, a thousand dials. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's a thousand dials. So you'll probably talk to maybe what, a hundred? People are out of a thousand calls. You might talk to. You might. I mean, you could talk to a hundred people or two. You know, 150 or something like that. I don't know. I don't know how many you'll talk to, but the object yeah. is is just to make the the, I, the thing about the thousand call challenge is that is that you have to overwhelm yourself with business. Like you just have to over like people are holding back too much and they're not they're not I mean you gotta fill your cup up of how much you can handle. Okay, so you make a ton of calls, right? Uh I try to. Uh so it's it's my plan. Um Cool. So let's let's role play real quick. You ready? Uh, I guess so. Yeah. Uh, I'm the I call you, you call me. I'm the owner. Ring, ring, ring. Hello. Hi, is uh, oh, shit. <laughs> you got me off, off guard. Uh, cause, uh, all right, we'll start this over. Ring, yeah. ring, ring. Hello. Hi, is this Ricky? Yep. Hey, Ricky, it's uh, Matt Krieger with Keller Williams Real Estate. How are you doing today? Doing good, man. How about you? Hey, I'm doing great, man. Thank you for asking. Um, sure. Hey, I was just giving you a quick call. I just want to let you know that we just listed a home in your neighborhood over on 48th Avenue. Yeah. Um, it's a two-bedroom, two-bath house, and, uh, you know, great little spot, and we love doing business in the neighborhood. Just seeing at this time if you have any real estate needs uh, that we can help you with. All right, thank you. All right. Okay, you want me to just tear you up on it? 
Yeah, you can, go ahead. Uh, I'm a big boy. I'm about relationships, and I think it's the little things that you say and don't say that add up to be huge later. Yeah, it, it's all about efficiency, right? And then when you're with your family, give them 100% of you. Turn your phone off if you have to. So yeah. just look at the brands. Decide which one you want to align yourself with. Don't worry about the money so much because if you're going to go to 100 sales and to you know over 100 sales a year, long term, then it really doesn't matter. You know, I think the brand is more important than the nickel and diming part of it. So you need to just look at your market as a whole and say what brand has the best reputation. Who who do I want to really align myself with? You know. And then, and then take a look at the numbers and just make sure every, you feel good about everything and then go. I want to be around the highest quality agents, not the most agents. All right, man. That's really all I had. Let me know if you have any more questions, man. All right, man. I all appreciate right. you taking a second to, to make it that simple. Sure. See you, buddy. All right, man. All right. What's up, guys? So, um, Friday... I'm headed to a listing appointment. It's not really a listing appointment. It's uh, getting a listing. <laughs> like we're just going there to sign papers. Um, so I'm meeting the photographer there. We're going to handle that. And then I'm gonna show about 10 condos to a buyer that called me out of the blue yesterday that was a referral. So I'm gonna go to a listing appointment and then I'm gonna show about 10 condos. That'll be my morning. And then I'm going to have lunch with a client who already has their property listed with me. Then I'm going to preview a complex. Uh, there's some work being done to a complex um, that I have a client that owns in. And they want me to go down and just take a look and see what the progress is and give them, a, give them kind of like a progress report type situation. So, it's a beautiful day. Uh, we're having a little bit of cold front. It's 56 degrees right now. It doesn't feel like 56. Uh, check out the beach. Not to be a pessimist at all, but we are kind of in the middle of the longest bull market ever in history. And so something's gonna happen somewhere. And I'm so looking forward to it. You know, I mean, I hate it for everybody that's not going to be prepared, but but I'm going to be prepared. And it's Mother Nature, basically. Like you can't stop it. Um, you know, you have to you have to be ready and understand how to take advantage of the situation. And my goal is going to be during that time to to coach you guys through and to mentor you through that. Uh, downturn through that correction through that recession through the crash whatever you want to call it um, it's coming at some point this bull market can't last forever Okay guys, so I got that listing. Of course, I told you that it was just, you know, going there to sign it. We signed it for three nineteen nine, which is, is good. It's a really nice condo. Um, but listen, I just sent an email out this morning about kind of my struggle and that I, uh, you know, I lost everything in the crash and I came back and stuff and it was a real inspirational kind of email. No links to buy anything, no links to watch a YouTube video, just straight value just providing value and I got I've already got you know, this was about an hour or so ago and I've already got like six emails back about people telling me how much business they're doing because they've been following me and implementing what I'm what I'm sharing with everybody and um, 
just how like much I've helped them and how much they relate um, and it's just amazing it's just so humbling it's so amazing what's happening right now um, with zero to diamond and the inspiration that is providing everybody not just real estate agents just everybody um, just just the people see you go through the struggle and see you work your way out of it and grind so hard every single day um, it just inspires people to want to take action and start to try to aspire to accomplish their own dreams and realize their own ambitions and and reach their own goals 